This video is a response to a question in the Anime Studio Forum on how to animate words through a photograph or through a person's head. Um, you have to use masking. It's kind of hard to explain, so I'll just walk through it. And if you follow through, you should be able to do this, no problem. I have a picture on the bottom layer, and then I have this um, text layer above it. And what I'm going to do is mask out the text by um, going to frame zero, adding a group layer, um, left clicking and dragging it into uh, the text into the uh, group layer, and then um, I'm going to add a new vector layer, which is going to be the mask. And I'm going to drag that below the text and double click the group layer to turn the masking on, hide all, and <clears throat> in the mask layer everything's disappeared because we haven't created the mask yet. Um, so you need to double click the mask layer, go into masking and select uh, clear the mask, then add this layer invisibly to it, and hit OK. And what we're going to do now is draw um, a shape where we want the words to appear. So we want them to appear going in his the left side of his head. Um, I'm gonna add some points to um, kind of wrap around the inner ear so it kind of looks like it's disappearing into his head. And I'm going to uh, extend the mask off the canvas so the words don't get cut off, cut off when they're animating. Um, you can make it pretty big. And then I'm going to add another shape layer over on the right side of the head and do the same thing. Add some points, kind of shape around the ear, and extend <clears throat> the mask all the way out of the frame. And then all you have to do is animate the text layer. Um, clicking on the text layer we can see where it's everything is so I'm gonna rotate it just a little bit just so uh, that looks about right so it'll pass through his head normally or you know through his ears so we'll go to uh, frame one or frame zero go down the timeline to I don't know 54 and drag the layer through his head, so it pops out the other side of his ear. Let's make this a little longer. Let's go 72 frames. Have that come out, and um, oops. and then just export animation. Um, I'll leave it at 100 frames so we can see what it looks like. call it your movie I guess. I'm just gonna render it really low so it renders faster. And let's see, let's move this into the frame. And should be done here in a second. And there it is. Um, as you can see in the movie it looks like it's passing through his head or through his ears, I should say. And that's it. Hope that helps.